what is aerodynamic optimization? We like to use the analogy of watering your garden with a gardening hose. So imagine you're out watering your yard and you've got to hit that farthest out corner of your yard. You've got your thumb over the nozzle, the hose is fully stretched out. What do we all do? We start to raise our arm up and up and up to try to maximize the distance that water is going to travel. As we raise our arm up though, we eventually send that water jet too high and we're losing distance because it's going too high in the air. So then we lower our arm back down, bring that flight back lower and lower, but eventually we lose distance because that water jet's coming out too low. Somewhere in between those two is the correct height for us to hold our arm to get maximum distance from the spigot. We do the exact same thing when we're looking at dimple pattern optimization. Each dimple pattern naturally flies in a different window. And as aerodynamics engineers, it's our job to determine what that window is. And we do so by changing the depth of the dimples by using what we call an edge angle series. That edge angle series allows us to vary the depths of the dimples on that ball without changing the pattern to see how the pattern responds aerodynamically. So as we go through this edge angle series, changing the depths of the dimples very, very slightly, we're ultimately able to determine where that pattern naturally flies to maximize its distance performance. When we talk about the depth difference, we're talking about a difference on the order of two tenths of a thousandth of an inch. For some context, that's about the size of a human red blood cell. Through the process of designing different dimple patterns and then subsequently optimizing those different dimple patterns, we have the ability to tailor individual aerodynamic packages specific to different products. Truefeel is going to necessitate a different aerodynamic package than Velocity, which will need different performance than AVX, which will need a different flight window than Pro V1X. And through the process of developing different patterns and optimizing those different patterns, finding out which ones fly best in those desired peak windows, we're able to give each individual golfer, each product, its own customized aerodynamic package that optimizes and maximizes its performance. So what's the takeaway? You can rest assured that your golf ball has been optimized for your performance needs.